If you care about the TikTok ban, you're going to want to see this. This website is called Capital Trades. You can go down and click politicians and you can enter the name of any of the politicians that you saw asking questions today and see what they invest in. Like Dan Crenshaw. Representative Crenshaw was one of the more belligerent members today of the committee. But I think it's understandable when you see what he invests in, in Alphabet, Amazon, Apple, Meta, all companies that stand to benefit from this TikTok ban. I brought this up earlier in the week, but a lot of people didn't see it. But the thing that you have to realize is this TikTok ban really isn't a ban on TikTok. Here's a bill, links in my bio, but it actually seeks to give the government the ability to criminalize or ban pretty much anything, or at least anything connected to the internet or is any kind of technology. Mark Warner, the senator who introduced this bill, is a tech sector venture capitalist investor. Looking through his disclosures, he invests in pretty much every sector that this bill would touch. He's not on TikTok, but he is other places where you can find him and let you know how you feel about his internet censorship bill. While you're on those other apps, maybe check out these people. These are just the house reps on this committee who have investment conflicts. There's a lot of them. Politicians really like their insider trading. I mean, it's hard to blame them. Rep Harshberger here disclosed four different buys of Meta stock earlier this year. Wouldn't you know, in that time, the stock price went up from 141, the price that she bought it up, and now it's 204. Rep Harshberger here saw a 44% return on that investment in less than three months. Again, it's easy to see why they really like insider trading. If you want another fun game, search the names of all the politicians who talked about protecting children today and their history on voting on gun reform. I just don't know that many schools that have had to lock down because of TikToks.